solution so to perform this question we will apply another method that is called so suppose I'll put root under x is equal to y that is x is equal to y square so differentiate with respect to x respect to x that is dx by dx is equal to dy square by dx okay that means d it means 1 is equal to 2 dy by dx so that is dx is equal to 2 dy by okay so here is the result of indication when and yet here we have value 0 to 1 so when x is equal to 0 the value of y will be 0 and when x is equal to 1 the value of y will be 1 so 0 to 1 you under x dx so here it becomes uh, that this means uh, we have uh, we have obtained the value of when x is equal to 0 y is equal to 0 that is 0 x is equal to 1 y is equal to 1 so 1 and we have suppose uh, root under x is equal to y into and here is the value of dx is 2y dy uh, 2y dy by dx okay that means uh, and here will be 2y dy so that means y into 2 into dy so it means 0 to 1 and then it will be 2y square dy okay so here is the value so that means it means f of y is equal to y square this y square this is a constant term okay so here the value of a is equal to 0 b is equal to 1 and n h is equal to b minus a is equal to 1 so now and f a plus r h means if the value of a is 0 so it means um, and here we will put this top in here okay so that means a plus r h square so it becomes that means 0 plus r h square is equal to that becomes r square h square so we have uh, 0 to 1 and here it will be um, 2y square dy is equal to this is a constant term so here it will be 2 and here limit has changed to 0 yes summation r is equal to 1 yeah? and here the value of f a plus r is r square h square h square so 2 limit has changed to 0 we will take out h square out h into h square r is equal to 1 and r square and here um, it will be limit s tends to 0 to it will be h cube and here the we know the formula the formula of this is r n, n, n plus 1 to n plus 1 either we can perform directly use the formula or we can or we can put the value of r is equal to 1 up to n okay so now and it will also give the result out is this okay so either we can use this or we can use this so that becomes i will use this n n plus 1 2n plus 1 by 6 is equal to 2 limit as tends to 0 and we will multiply this term n s by h okay so we will multiply this term by h that means plus h 2n s plus h by 6 so 2 into limit as tends to 0 here the value of n h is 1 this is 1 1 plus h 2 plus h by 6 is the limit of h tends to 0 so that means 2 by 6 into 1 1 plus 0 2 plus 0 that means the value of this is 2 by 3 so this is the required solution